Hi friends, my name is Jess. Welcome to Books Past Bedtime. Today we are going to be playing a very fun game. This was created by Mara over at Mara Reads. I will link her channel down below. Definitely go check her out. She is one of my best bookish friends here on booktube and creates some really great content. So this is called the book association game and the theory behind it is that there are a lot of books, particularly like YA and fantasy books that have very similar titles and share a lot of the same words. So Mara has put together this list of 151 words that she has seen commonly throughout book titles. There are 15 rounds in this game and in each round you generate a random number go to that word on the list and you have 10 seconds to name a book title with that word in it and the goal is just to get as many points as you can and you're not allowed to look at your bookshelves or goodreads i don't know how you would do that in 10 seconds anyway but i think that's the point <laughs> before i started filming this i kind of was like i should go through goodreads and like read all my book titles so i can have some stuff that i'm like uh, can't remember but i didn't do that because i'm not a cheater so i'm probably gonna do really bad at this challenge but oh well <laughs> i have my laptop here so let's just get started so I'm going to first generate a random number. So for round one, my first word is number 36. The first word is blue. And for this, my book is Blue Lily Lily Blue by Maggie Stiefvater. So yay, one point, first round, doing great. All right, round two. We've got number 32, and that is House, House on the Cerulean Sea by TJ Klune. All right, round three. We got number 69, and we have Sky. Sky. All right, couldn't think of anything for that one. Sky, what the hell? I feel like I should have been able to come up with something for that one, but alas. Round four, got 140. Happy, more happy than not by Adam Silvera. All right, now I've got three points. Round five, I got 103. I got Book, The Book Thief by Marcus Zusak. Wow, I'm doing better than I thought I was going to. All right, round six is number 127, and my word is father. 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 I don't know. <laughs> I don't have one for that one either. Oh my gosh. I have no idea. Father. That's a hard one. Round seven, I got number 70. My word is fall. Oh, can I use like different things like the year we fell from space by A.S. King? Does that count? <laughs> Does that count as like a half point? I'm gonna give myself a half point. <laughs> All right, round eight, I got number six. That is King. Um, the Wicked King by Holly Black. Got another point. So now I've got five and a half. <laughs> All right, round nine, we got number 21. That is Fall again. I'm confused. She has it on here twice. Mare, what the heck? I don't know. I still don't know one for this other than the one I already named and got a half point for, so. Mare, fix your document. All right, round 10, I got number 17 and my word is fall. Fall. Nope. Oh, my word is young. <laughs> Just kidding. All right, round 10, I got the number 17, and my word is young. I'm cheating. <laughs> young. I don't know. I don't, I don't know a book with that title. Fuck. I don't know. <laughs> so I've got about half. I'm, at, I'm doing like a little bit over 50% because of that half point, so I'm doing all right. All right, round 11, I got the number 45, and my word is beach, and that is super easy. Beach Read by Emily Henry. Mare got this one in her video as well. All right, round 12, I got number 149, and my word is people. Normal People by Sally Rooney. This is fun, I'm having a great time. All right, round 13, I got the number 54, and my word is shadow. Shadow and Bone by Lee Bardugo. My mind, I'm so smart. Round 14, almost to the end. I got number 136 and my word is after. And I'm just gonna do after by Anna Todd because that's the first thing that comes to my mind even though that book is trash. And we have made it to the last round. My random number for this round is number 79 and my word is murder. A Good Girl's Guide to Murder by Holly Black. 
Woo! Man, I killed this challenge. So my final tally is 10.5 points out of 15. I think I did pretty good. Honestly, a lot better than I thought I was gonna do, so. This was so much fun. I definitely recommend you guys doing this challenge. It was honestly really a lot of fun. Mare is so creative and I just love it. So great. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you being here. All relevant links will be in the description down below, including Mare's original video as well as the Google Doc so that you can make a video just like this. And that's going to be all for me today. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.